public health and wellness. Ms. Robinson speaking. Can I help you? Yes. Would you like to make a complaint? What's the name of the facility? And the address? Twas the day before Christmas, and I was inspecting a janky cafe needing serious correcting. The placard was held to the window with flies. When I walked in the kitchen, I saw fear in their eyes. Health department, routine inspection, who's in charge? The manager nestled in his office, I think, while some guy with big hair shaved at the prep sink. And Grace in her hairnet, and I in my cap, walked into the kitchen to deal with this crap. The fluorescent lights flickered harsh from the ceiling, giving luster of mug shots to the crew unappealing. When out on the floor, there arose angry chatter. A worker had sneezed on a fresh cold cut platter. The meat had already been dropped on the floor though, so there was an additional risk of contracting Noro. The guy running the meat station kept threatening my death, and he claimed he was sanitized by the vodka on his breath. The raw bacon read over 90 degrees. It's like they were trying to breed a disease. When what to my overwhelmed eyes should appear, but a family of rats bringing shivers of fear. When right to the left, I observed an employee washing her hands wrong just to annoy me. I wondered just what they were doing this for. As the sous chef dipped her hair in the soup du jour, with all the criticals observed at this business, I knew I was closing this cafe for Christmas. After calling in Janet and confirming with Kelly, the papers were served like a bowl full of jelly. We spoke not a word, but went straight to our work. They made faces at Grace and called David a jerk. But close them we must, so we quelled their defiance, and stood watch as they fixed their flagrant non-compliance. And the placard was hung on the window with care, with the hopes it would make Louisville eaters aware. When I got home tired, I realized the true meaning of the season, being thankful for the things we love, like the three-day Christmas weekend. <laughs>